Well, hello, hello, everybody, and welcome to a Monte Rico Gaming Special. Transport Fever Special. This one is a hot one. You guys are going to have to sit down for this one, because if you do what I did, you might pass out. Now, as you guys may or may not know, I was, I was part of doing the beta testing and things like that, so that's how I got some early access and have played to the game. But one little thing, a little bug that happened that I happen to miss that was such a popular bug that it seems to stick is, well, you guys know how we usually run freight, most likely. And which is, you know, you, you get the materials and you drop it off at a cargo stop and, well, let's take a wider outlook. Let's bring up our routes. As you can see, this is kind of normal, right? We have con some construction materials, like we've got stone being brought up here and to the construction material plant. And then we have these cargo trucks bringing, I mean, they're, they're little, you know, they're not trucks, but you guys get the point. Eventually they'll be trucks. These guys are bringing the ones on the red line, because this, this episode is all about the red line, is bringing it over to this cargo stop. Did you know? Now this is where you're going to go, Monty, you're crazy. You are nothing but crazy, and I thought so too. And this 100% shout out, to, I guess there's some videos out there that talk about this too, and I missed it. Uh, but uh, Gunner Koenig, I'm not sure how you want to pronounce it, but here's the little post here on my comments. I love it. You guys keep it 100%. I agree. This is a pro tip. I didn't know. But big warning. This was definitely a bug, and I know I haven't even shown it yet. But now I think it is going to be part of the game, and once I show you a little bit more, I'll talk about what I hope happens with it in the future. Line 7. This point right here, what is it called? What is it? What is it? What are you called, my friend? Upper San Diego. I'm going to say uh, you. You are on the line seven. No, 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 no. What I want to know is which, oh, which stop are you? Oh my goodness. What am I? Do I have something not clicked on up here? No. No. Line seven. Where are you? Oh, sorry. Not line seven. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Line nine. Makes a lot more sense when you have the proper red line up. Okay, we've got more lines going on. Now, here's what I wanted to talk about with line nine. This is another reason why you should name your lines. Upper Sandy Care. Sandy Car, Sandy Acre, whatever it is. Uh, this one right here. We're going to remove it. And we are going to add station bus stop. That's right, bus stop. We're going to hit the B key to bulldoze. We're going to just blow this up as soon as we have money, which I don't. We're going to borrow some money right now because this is just for fun's sake. This map is going to be kind of our little 101 map that we're going to be talking about, hoping about, testing things out. And uh, Gunner on my YouTube page posted, did you know? And I definitely did not. I've been posting around. Some people didn't even believe it. They're saying, Monty, I don't believe you. I think you're crazy. I think you're pulling my leg. There is no way that you can use a bus stop to drop off goods. Now, think about it. The stop, I'm not needing to transfer anything else. So I still need the cargo stop over here because I do need somewhere to store the goods to be picked up by the trucks. But after that, they're just getting dropped off and going to wherever they need to go. So now that I'm, I'm, we're gonna, I'm gonna prove it. Road vehicle. This guy's test dummy number one. Uh, we're just gonna go test one. He's gonna prove that he will pick up construction materials and bring them back to the bus stop and drop them off for the industrial area. Now, quick note: I have tested this out with the tram stops of this nature and they didn't work but it does seem to work for the bus stops now what i would hope and why yes this is a bug i know some of you guys are going to be like no money this has been around from the beginning it's not a bug no it's a bug that people liked so it's sticking around but i don't want to be using a bus stop to drop off cargo what i would love to see is also a freight stop which does not work as storage but works as simply, come on, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, but works as simply a drop-off point. Now, I know I guess they could keep it out because they're worried people are going to get confused. Oh, let's see. Will he drop these four off at the bus station? 
I'm telling you, yes, he will. I know you guys are going, no, this is impossible. I told you, some of you are going to pass out. I passed out. My wife came in. She's like, "What? what's going on, Monty? What happened? And I'm like, hey, the the there's there's trains. I can stop things off at the bus station. And then she just slapped me and walked off. She's like, I'm packing my bags. You passed out over a, 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 a video game. Bus stop. Oh, I wish I was joking. Anyway, test number one for construction materials. Going to drop it off. Like I said, it had some issues with the tram. Stop. Now, that doesn't mean it only works for bus stops. The next test that Monty had a test. I had a test. Oh, my God. I just talked to myself as if I wasn't here. Anyway, what I tested. What about a passenger train station, right? What? What? What about that? I mean, I know it can't store goods. I would love a multi-use station that can do both things. However, what about just dropping off, I thought? What, what, could you drop off goods at a passenger station? And some of you guys were like, no, Monty, you can't. There's no way. There's no way you can do it. And yes, he just made money and dropped off those construction materials. This just happened. Construction materials just got dropped off at a bus station. Now, let me kind of try to blow your mind over here. Let's hope this works. Where is it? Oh no, is the train all the way already on the way back? Train number two. This is the first run he's ever done on the test run. So you guys are sitting here testing it with me. This guy's supposed to hold construction materials. Now, again, just like with the trucks, the main base where he is going must be a cargo station. Must be, must be, must be. Because the construction materials need to be stored at the station to pick up. However, again, to reiterate, what we're talking about in this episode is the drop-off trick bug tip. Hope it stays. Hope it gets worked out. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Anyway, it works now. My point is to blow your minds before the Thanksgiving weekend is over. And I had to put it to the test, and I figured if I'm testing it, I'm bringing you guys with me, and if it works, I'm uploading this, and wow, we're all going to be amazed. All I've done right now is test the bus line. However, since the goods were actually sitting here at the station, I am confident that this guy right here, look at that, filled up with all those construction materials, looking good, Mr. Man. Looking good. And like I said, I do plan to start up a 101 series. I just have not yet, but you guys are getting the first touch, the first taste of the small map I'm going to use to kind of talk about signaling, how to build from the very, very, very basics. However, I'm also using it for my test grounds with all this madness here. So let's drop in, like I said, first person mode for the final jump here. And we're gonna hop out right before we land in Bridport to see, will I pass out again? I don't know. I think I'm prepared. I, I'm, I'm, I'm ready, I'm braced. Is this gonna happen, my friends? Let's slow it down. Let's not press that button. No, train, come here. Come back, there you are. I put a little one-way signal there to force this guy over, and yes, this is a passenger station. See? Right? Passengers. Passenger station. Oh, yes, but here's what happened. I must have been here before. I must have lied earlier. Look at that. I all dropped off 363k. That was construction materials dropped off at a passenger station. And now, because it needs somewhere to sit, right? Since this is on a cargo station, put a truck station right by it that make sure that the truck station connects as you can see this white boundary on the track that's the containment area of this little station here and what's going to happen is this train cargo train keep this in mind freight train dropping off at a passenger train station unloading onto a truck cargo stop and then what's happening here monty come on now come on now let's blow mines on top of blowing mines this guy right here Road Vehicle 73, also known as Test 2. Come on now, don't let me down. Test 2. He's picking up construction materials, and where is he going to take these? I do not know. You guys are thinking, well, I don't know. Hopefully he's taking them over to a cargo stop in the industrial district. No, no, he's not. I'm telling you, this is what's going to blow your mind. It's just not happening, and yes, the music is muted. I've had that up the whole time. I do apologize, but trains are doing well. Money is now on the way in. Paying off. Remember, pay off debts. 101 tip right there. This guy's going to come around the corner, and he's going to drop off these construction materials. Yes, again. 
at a already in use bus stop that is also being used to transport passengers. So I hope this episode, at least, you guys can tell me, Monty, you should have known this all along. I'm, I agree, I should have. This is sad. Fingers crossed we still keep this. Like I said, I would hope to see something in the future as far as, I mean, honestly, we'll at least see it as a mod. If we don't get a, uh, from the Urban Games here, a cargo stop, it'd be nice to see just a freight cargo stop. Uh, just like these bus stops here. All you'd have to do is reskin it and rename it. Come on, guys. Uh, I have no idea how to do it, but I'm sure it's going to come and everything is going to be good. And in a mod video I did, I saw this uh, parking truck stop that said no storage. And I didn't really understand it, but oh my goodness, now I understand it. It's a drop off, basically. Uh, but the great thing is, is downtowns are really expensive. And for example, look at that. If I wanted to put a cargo stop, that's almost a million down the drain. So just drop it off at a bus station, everybody. Drop it off at a train station. Fingers crossed this bug sticks around. Or not a bug if you don't want to call it a bug, but it is what it is. I'll see you guys next time. Stay tuned. I got more free play on the way. We've got more America campaign on the way. We've got more transport fever on the way. Don't you guys worry. Hope you guys had a fantastic Thanksgiving weekend. This ends it for me for the weekend. I will see you all next week. Stay tuned. We have, oh, 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 quick note, quick note. We've got some giveaways coming up in December. Three games, one of them, hint, hint, is Transport Fever. So make sure to subscribe, stay tuned, and uh, stay tuned for a video that will give details on what to do for the giveaway. It's going to be simple. You're just going to have to watch the video and post below in that video if you want one of the games. Anyway, stay tuned. I'll see you guys soon. Peace. <laughs>